Hey guys, Survival 101 here. As you can see, I've been busy at work. Uh, this is my new project for the winter. Um, so this is a geothermal greenhouse heating system here for a little hoop house and a cold frame. So essentially, um, geothermal heating in greenhouses uses the Earth's uh, average temperature of about 50 degrees below the frost line. Um, and you use that to your advantage as sort of a battery and um, take the heat from it in the winter time to keep your crops warm inside your hoop house. So essentially I've got a, about a five foot hole right here and then a trench coming out here that's a few feet deep. Um, I just went over different rocks and didn't try to take them out. I'm just gonna stack dirt on top of that, those pieces. And the greenhouse is going to go right over here. I'm going to build a hoop house and a cold frame inside the hoop house. And I'll be doing videos on that in the future. And essentially that should be able to get me to about a zone 8 or 9. Because we are in zone 5 here. Um, and those two layers of protection from the cold should be able to get me to that. So essentially... I just have uh, tubing here, four inch in diameter, and I ran that from over there. And that's the cold air from the greenhouse. At night, we'll blow in here with a fan, circulate through all these pipes down here. Um, there's about 50 feet right there. And then it'll come out the bottom line, go back into the greenhouse, and it should be around 45 degrees at that point. And at night, your cold hardy crops will be able to survive with 45 degrees easily. Um, this is not going to heat your greenhouse to 80 degrees. I mean, it's just enough to keep the plants alive at night and then during the daytime, uh, the greenhouse using the sun will heat itself up. But this is my attempt at making a geothermal greenhouse heating system. I'll be making more videos in the future and I'll update you guys on how it works out but I'm just gonna go ahead and fill this in now gotta dump all the soil back in there hey guys Rob 101 here as you can see I've got it almost completely covered up here um, running the two tubes out I've got one right near the surface that's going to be the cold air coming in, and then the warm air is the one below that, about a few feet. Still have this side over here to cover up, and I'm just running a fan over here um, to just heat up the system a little bit and see what it's capable of. I've got cold air coming out here, warm air going in there, which is good. Because it's about 90 degrees out here right now. So that'll work well in the winter time. But guys, thanks for watching and please subscribe for more.